Well, with the growing number of coronavirus cases here in Indiana, many families are starting to question their annual holiday plans. Boy, that's for sure. CBS 4's Darius Johnson explains what you need to consider while planning your trip. Six weeks until Thanksgiving and families are making plans to get together at the dinner table. However, recent coronavirus numbers mean it may be better to scale back the annual traditions. So you have to weigh that risk of the, the desire to do something you always do to make you feel normal in the middle of the pandemic to get together versus what's the risk of catching it and what's the risk of transmitting it to other people. Dr. Christopher Belcher with Ascension St. Vincent in Indianapolis says it's not just about the location of the gathering, but also who will be attending the event. If you have the elderly, if you have these extended family members who have medical problems all getting together, it can be a very bad situation, and there certainly are lots of family outbreaks that happen. Some alternative recommendations include virtual dinners or pandemic pods. That's where you'd meet with a small group, agree to restrictions, and limit social interactions to one another leading up to the event. Still, doctors recommend you wear masks, wash your hands, practice social distancing, and... If you're getting together in person, again, about two weeks before Thanksgiving, you may want to go into your own lockdown. Reporting in Indianapolis, I'm Darius Johnson. Experts also recommend getting your flu shot before the holidays. You got to do it. They say that can prevent confusion and chaos if you begin to feel sick before your gathering. Get your flu shot. It's got the it, thing to do it, this year. Got, got to do it. <laughs>